Hello you guys, welcome back to the channel. It is October 17th. Just got off of work. It is 4.30. I got home, changed into this, I don't know what you would call this. It's like a dress, but it's like a pajama. Right now, I'm about to put up these dishes and then wash some dishes and then clean up the kitchen. Put the clean ones here and leave them to dry. You gonna go potty? I'm gonna go take her out. Okay. Hola, say. I can't even see her. There she is. So it turns out she did have to use the restroom. Sometimes, like, I don't let her out with the leash, which I should. Sometimes she doesn't want to listen to me. I just do this. I just do that, and then she comes to me. But let me give him a treat. Here you go. Oh, and I gotta give him food, too. And I bought this little water fountain thing. Are you gonna let me speak? Lola. So she's mad because her sister's eating from her bowl stand. So what I'm gonna do is give her this on the floor so she can eat. Sora, no. Sora's so mean. See? That's all it was. Let me show you how the counter's looking. I haven't cleaned up or anything. So I'm just gonna like tidy up the kitchen, then I'm gonna go to the living room. But I'm so frustrated Hello to my loneliness I guess that ignorance is bliss Take me back to be more than new The wine to get out of cue Innocence can be a young man's game Signed up for the Hall of Shame I wish I knew How much I miss I know Okay, you guys, I am back and the kitchen is clean. I just have to take this to my car. So whenever I go grocery shopping, I could take my bags. And then we bought a cover seat for Damien's car for the back seat so that the girls don't get his car dirty. I just have to sweep and mop. Now I just have to clean the living room area. It's not bad, but... It needs to be clean. I'll get back with you guys after I sweep and mop. Okay, guys, I just got done sweeping and look at all that hair. If you want to have a dog, just keep that in mind that you're going to have to sweep a lot because they shed a lot. Let me go ahead and pick up this trash because they're already sniffing into it. Okay, so I am done sweeping and mopping i'm gonna get to a little stopping point so i'm just gonna take a break so i did have some sopa de conchas left over from yesterday and a little bit of chicken oh and i'm gonna have it with some queso fresco because that's my favorite thing ever so here is the chicken and then the sopa i'm just gonna heat them up together and i'm gonna have one dish to wash i love that I forgot to tell y'all, I did have some potatoes left over from Thursday or Friday. And it's just like a little bit left, so I'm going to go ahead and finish it. I hate having to throw away food, so I'm just trying to eat as much leftovers as possible. This is the little concoction I made. This is going to be probably a super long video. I thought I'd like make it up to y'all since I haven't been vlogging. I'm going to vlog my whole week. And y'all get to spend time with me. I'm going to try my first buy of this. Here's my first buy. Come on, focus. It's not going to focus. 
That's so bomb. I just got done eating. It is 6.17. So yesterday, I was like, I'm craving some muffins, some blueberry muffins. So I made them. So I'm going to eat the rest of it. What's all? Mm-mm. Yeah. Mm-mm. I love them as well. It is 9 o'clock. I did just end up watching YouTube videos for the rest of the night. I know I'm like super late, but at the beginning of the month, I like to fill out my, my journal slash planner and fill out everything like any appointments, my payments, any like plans, parties, whatever. So that's what I did. I filled it out. So I will see y'all tomorrow. Good morning, you guys. It is the next day. It is 6.03. I did wake up before 6. I just, I just took out the girls to go to the restroom and I brushed my teeth. But it is officially cold, like cold, cold in the mornings. I slept with like a lot of blankets last night. We still have the AC on, but like I kind of forgot how cold felt like. Holy crap, tomorrow's going to be a low of 36. So today is going to be a high of 63. What the heck? Thursday, Friday, Saturday is going to be a high of 80, like in the 80s. How does that make sense? Anyways, it's super cold today. I'm going to wear warm clothing. About to do my makeup really quick. I bought a TV for my room. I got it at Best Buy for 100 bucks. It's like a little tiny one. Let me do my makeup really quick. And I'll show you afterwards how it looks. Because if I show you how I do my makeup, this video is going to be like extra, extra long. This is the fit of the day. Head on this sweater I got from a garage sale. It makes me look fat. But I like being comfy for work. And then I got these pants. And then I'm wearing... I don't know how I feel about the pants. It is 6.48. I think I might go to McDonald's and get something. I'm really hungry. But yeah, I'm about to head to work. And I will see y'all after. Okay, guys. So I changed the fit again. This is the official final fit. I just changed the hat and the jeans and the shoes. Okay, I am back, you guys. I got home at like 5.20. It is 5.40 right now. I took out the girls. And they're eating now. And I'm so proud because Lola is not scared of the fountain anymore. I have to like tell her that it was water. Right now, I gotta do some preparations for my burritos. I don't have to do much because not many people ordered potatoes. But I'm gonna go ahead and make a little bit of beans and I'm gonna make the rice. Oh, and the salsa I gotta make too. And I'll show you how I make all that. So that's all I'm gonna be doing today and then I'm gonna clean afterwards. I already ate. I had Taco Bell, which wasn't so great. But it is what it is. I'll tell you how many calories I consumed today. Uh, let me just calculate it on my app and then I'll let y'all know. Okay, you guys, I look bald, but I just want to have my hair back. So I did get my hair cut like with bangs and stuff. I like how the bangs look, but it's just not for me because I have to sell my bangs every day. That's why I have this little headband thing because so my bangs are not in the way. But I'm about to make the fries. I'm sorry if you hear the girls in the back. I usually use like actual tomatoes, but if you don't have that, I use diced tomatoes. My mom would probably be judging me if she saw me use this kind of tomatoes. And I'm going to use my Ninja Blender, just like the small one. And I'm going to pour some of this in here. Probably like a fourth full. And I just put the rest in the fridge. And then I get some garlic, like a garlic clove. I try to do like half a garlic clove, depending how much rice I'm making. Like this much. So I put that in there. And then I get some of this onion. I just cut just a tiny bit so I don't want it to taste too much like onion. Okay, so like this much, like a fourth of an onion. And then I um, get hot water. I kind of went over the max line, but it's okay. So I'm going to go ahead and blend it. I forgot one ingredient. Hold up. So you need to get, I don't know what this is called, like tomato seasoning. It has a red lid. It's like the chicken bouillon container, but it's the red one. So it's the tomato flavoring. So I use about... Mm, half a tablespoon just a little bit more and if you need more you can add later on i'm gonna go ahead and put this up clean as you go i'm gonna leave this out just in case i need more seasoning so this is my all-time favorite pan to use 
It is a Princess House 10 inch stainless steel. If you're interested in buying Princess House, let me know because my mom sells it. So I'm gonna heat this up to like medium high and I use extra virgin olive oil. That much. And there's no exact measurings like to make rice. Well, for me, I can't really give you a recipe for it. You just kind of eyeball it. While that heats up, I'm going to go to the restroom because I'm about to shit my pants. So, I'll be back. Okay, you guys. So, I'm about to get the rice. I put it in this container because I always make rice, like, all the time. So, I put it in this big-ass container. Let me see how much I need. Um, maybe another cup. I don't want to make too much rice. Okay, that should be enough. Now I'm going to fry up the rice until golden. So make sure you stay here at all times until you put this into this. So I'm just going to be here. I usually cook it on medium high or high. I'll get back with y'all whenever it's like lightly brown. Okay, guys. So I had to mute this part because... I had the vent on and it was really loud but well, basically what I'm saying here is I lowered the temperature because the rice was already golden brown and then after that I poured in the mixture I made the tomato and the seasoning poured that in there and then you mix it and then you cover so I do let it boil for a little bit and then put the lid and then I'll be checking on it every now and then to see if it needs more water. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and put a lid on it actually right now. Just keep it on low. I think she needs to use the restroom. I'm going to go take her out real quick. And when I get back, I have to change out this battery because it's about to die. Okay, you guys. So I just got back from taking the girls out. I'm going to go ahead and try the rice. Let me get a spoon. I'm just going to add a little tiny bit more of the seasoning. Just like that much. I'm going to mix it in. I went ahead and put the lid back on there. And I'm just going to wait it out and see if it needs more water later. I'm going to make the salsa. So I'm going to get this 2.6 quart Dutch oven. I'm going to fill it up like halfway with water. Put the stove top on high for the salsa. You're going to need tomatillos. I have two. Look at this big ass one. Four, six, eight. I'm going to put some serranos. Two serranos. Three. I'm going to put some chile de arbol as well. Five chile de arbol. Oh shoot, I don't know if I have jalapenos. <gasps> I don't have any jalapenos. Oh, I have one jalapeno. I'm gonna add another serrano. I'm sure I'm gonna add all the old tomatillos because this is gonna be spicy. And then we add some garlic. What are you eating, Sora? So that girl goes into everything. I'm gonna add two cloves. Can I add a little bit more water? Okay, where was I? Did I put the other garlic in? I don't remember. I probably didn't. So I'm going to add another garlic. Bless you. Okay, another garlic to the boiling water. Um, What else do I need to do? It's honestly so freaking hard vlogging and cooking. I don't know how people do it. So I'm going to try the rice. It's literally like almost done. I'm going to put it back on low. And in hopes that the water absorbs into the rice because right now it's a little bit too much watery let me show y'all it's too watery but it's all good as long as it tastes good right i think i'm gonna go ahead and make potatoes just to be on the safe side i'm just gonna make a little bit just in case somebody like to texas me last minute that they want a burrito with potatoes once the tomatillo changes like to a lighter green you go ahead and put in the blender like so this one's ready to so you don't want to let it boil for too long. So I just put everything into the blender. What you're going to add is some diced tomato. Preferably fresh tomato. So just like that. And then I'm going to add some of this seasoning. The tomato seasoning. And I add salt. I'm going to add some salt. 
and then I'm gonna add cilantro. Okay, and the trick to having like fresh cilantro, you uh, put it in a bag and in a cup. You leave it with water, like the stems and everything, and you wrap it, and then it grows. Honestly, it like grows more fluffy. I got this this past weekend for Friday, and look how pretty it still looks. I'm just gonna grab like this much cilantro. I do put the ends as well. I'm gonna go ahead and wash it real quick. Okay, so now it's ready to blend. Trust me, you need to try this and your cilantro is gonna last a lot longer. I think one time it lasted like almost a month. So I'm going to blend it. So I'm gonna go ahead and try it and see if it needs any more salt. The girls are gonna start running over here because I'm gonna open this bag of chips. It's probably gonna be spicy. I don't like spicy. To me, it's spicy. It's like burning my throat. It does need a little bit more salt. I'm gonna add some more of the tomato seasoning. Another spoonful and a tiny bit of salt. And then this pot that I had the water in, I'm gonna go ahead and dump the water in the sink. Move on, mess. And then my mom told me to do this. You have to boil your salsa so that it lasts longer so i'm just gonna pour it pour it in this what's it called dutch pan and then we're just gonna boil it i already cut up all the potatoes have them right here and i'm about to cook them on the stove top and i'll show you all the ingredients i use so i'm hoping they'll f all the potatoes will fit in this one right here we're gonna try it out so if y'all had if y'all have dogs on one there's just gonna be a lot of barking in the background so i'm gonna put it on medium high and i put some um extra virgin olive oil and i'm gonna put this in there i'm gonna season it with paprika onion tart powder garlic powder thyme black pepper and some salt and after i season them and toast them for like a good minute i put water and then i cover it so that the potatoes can be soft and that's gonna be the last thing i make today after this i'm gonna clean up that way i'm ready for tomorrow it is starting to get a little darker early on the day it is literally seven o'clock I'm drinking lemon water. I'm gonna go ahead and write down all my orders on this notebook. That way in the morning, I just have it ready and just go down my list. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now. Okay guys, it is now 7.30. I washed some of the dishes, not the pans. I'm letting everything cool down. Yeah. So not really. I was bonding with your sister. So I'm just gonna get this on camera because I usually like to get down, sit down on the ground, and just like rub her face, Alola's, and just like tell her she's beautiful, that she's smart, and she's a good girl. Just have like a little bonding moment. And this one comes around, she gets jealous, and I can't do that. Sora, stop. I finally got done. Okay, girls. They're literally like playing right here. I just got done making the potatoes, rice, and the salsa. The beans are still not done yet, so I'm waiting on that. Anyways, that is it for the day. I wash all the dishes. I'm gonna wake up super early tomorrow because I want to get to work early. I have a lot of stuff to do at work. It is 7.50. I'm just going to chill a little bit, let the girls play, and then I'll take them out and then put them in their kennel. Good morning, you guys. It is 5.20. I'm about to start the cooking process. Good luck to me. And I'm going to show you what I did when I got home. But all I did was take out the girls. And then I decided I will go to my parents' house. I went to my parents' house. I was there for like two hours and then I went home and here I am. Look how my hair looks. It's cute. Anyways, I'm about to shower and then go to sleep. It is 8.40. Really not much to my day today. I need to get home tomorrow and probably just vlog tomorrow and then that'll be the end for this video. And I'll probably do another vlog for the weekend. But we'll see. 
So I'll see you guys tomorrow.